Hey everybody, it's Kathy Boyle. I am delivering to you today a video of my blog. So this week, Effective Strategies for Success was increase your social IQ. So now's the time while you have a little extra time and a lot of people are on Facebook, on LinkedIn, on social media, now's the time to increase your social IQ. If you don't have a website, that's the first place to start. If you need a website designer, we have several great ones with different price points. Reach out to me and I'm happy to connect you. We have lots of Circle of Influence members who can also make recommendations. Number two, if you do not have a social channel, if you're not active on LinkedIn, uh, Facebook, interest, Instagram, Twitter, you can choose one channel. You can choose multiple channels. But the thing is to have a message, be consistent, and be on there on a regular basis. So it is not selfish to think about generating income right now. If you generate income, you take care of yourself, your family, and you can help others. So increase your social IQ. Think about ways that you can post, be part of the community. Find new business this way, and you can do it in a very authentic manner. Really, the goal of social media is to actually create relationships with people. So if you're in a LinkedIn group, you post in there, comment on other people's posts rather than just blandly posting. Um, the same thing on Facebook. In groups, I'm in a lot of vegan groups, vegan animal groups, uh, cooking groups, because I love to cook. And so when I share my animals, and I share my animal stories, and I share my food, it really does create a relationship. And I'm a little bit different than other advisors in the marketplace. People have actually told me that they chose me because of my animal rescue work, that they felt like I had a heart. So a lot of Wall Street people do not have a heart, so it's a nice way to uh, differentiate yourself. So increase your social IQ while we are sheltering at home.